For more videos visit forthesakeofeducation.com Alright guys, now we're gonna do this problem that says determine the magnitude of the resultant force acting on the screw eye and its direction measured uh, clockwise from the uh, positive x-axis which will be this way so basically we're gonna just divide the forces into x and y components so let's take this to be um, the first force form so the resultant force on the x is gonna be equal to this force and this force So this force right here is divided into the x component and the y component and this force is divided into an x and a y. So we add the x's together, we add this force and this force together by doing negative 6k cosine of 60 which is this force right here plus 2k cosine of 45 and this is equal to negative 1.58 k and then the resultant force in the y is going to be the addition of the y force this is going to be this force and this force added together which this force right here is negative 6 k sine of 60 minus 2 k sine of 45 both forces are aiming down so they're both negative that is equal to negative 6.61 k so the resultant force in Cartesian vector form will be negative 1.58 k in the i minus 6.61 k in the j which let me it's going to be negative 1 and negative 6.6 .6 be somewhere right there so that will be the resultant force and they want you to find this angle right here because it's the angle that it forms with the x and they also want you to find the magnitude the magnitude can be found by doing the x component square plus y component square added and square rooted so you plug these two numbers in right here and you're gonna get that this is equal to 6.8 for the magnitude now to find the angle that it forms with the x first what we're gonna do is we're gonna find this angle and this angle is found let's call this angle phi and let's call this angle beta so to find phi you need to do the tangent inverse of the y component over the x component this is the y component and this is the x component so when you plug this number sent to this uh, formula you're gonna get that this is equal to 76.17 degrees and to find theta which is this angle right here all you gotta do is 180 degrees minus phi which comes out to be about 103 degrees roughly final answer for the angle final answer for the magnitude please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help thank you